multiple times a week, I get the random tweet or something that's like, if you kill Coop, I'm like. <laughs> one of the uh, teachers was like, well, I have one question for you. Are you the daddy? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Well, and then, then her husband the was like, no, she's like, no, 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 I'm gonna ask him. Oh, you the daddy. <laughs> we also had a big response when we had that character Sean, when Sean um, yeah. got yeah. killed. Yeah, yeah, people were yeah. like crying and yeah. we were dealing with uh, addiction and suffering in silence. I thought that that was very uh, moving and kind of had me examining my own life. Yeah. I think mine was uh, Coop getting kicked out by her parents because of her sexuality. And I think it, it touched me because it resonated so much with the kids out here today. The fans just flood me with their stories and what they're going through, and a, a lot of people are going through that, you know, and I'm happy that, again, the writers. That place just isn't who I am. And this is? No, you decide who you want to be. I think the most gratifying thing has been fans reaching out saying, like, I feel seen or I feel heard or yeah. I finally feel like my story is out there or, you know, thank you for telling this story. It's what happened to me. And, you know, we're helping someone who maybe didn't feel like they were part of mainstream or didn't feel like America saw them, helping them feel seen and feel validated has been unbelievable. I got a message from a, um, a high school teacher who said that the show made her see her kids differently. She was a white teacher, but she taught in a predominantly African-American school. She sent me a sort of a long message that basically said it sort of altered the way she saw her kids differently and how she, and it made her want to sort of be a better teacher for them. So that was, that was one of the most gratifying things for me. One of the things we're super proud of is that the show manages to stay grounded and um, very sort of true to life and it is inspired by true events. And so these sort of last four episodes, we really put our characters through it. You, it's the fun part of watching them sort of reconcile with all of that.